This lesson deals with supplemental problem 4.8. You can find this problem in the ECE 201 ebook in the chapter 4 supplemental problems on page 8. Given this op amp circuit with some resistors, a 5 volt source, and a 3k load, can you find the current in the load? Now in the chapter 4 notes, we develop models for the inverting, non-inverting, and differential amplifier structures. Here I've highlighted one of those three structures, which we call the non-inverting amplifier. Now we develop models for these, and so you can replace this circuit by its model, no matter where you hook it up. If you recall, the model was that it drew no current, so it's an open circuit here, and whatever voltage is present here to ground shows up here, amplified by one plus the resistor ratio. Because we had a voltage control voltage source, we have zero output resistance, so we get a fixed voltage at this node, dependent on whatever the voltage is here. Okay, let's replace this non-inverting amplifier by its model. Let's see if we can analyze the circuit. So I have the 4K and 12K resistor hooked up to my non-inverting amplifier, drawing no current, and then I get a voltage gain of three times whatever this voltage is. Because the 4K and the 12K share the same current, I can find the voltage V sub X with a voltage divider. So 12K over 12K plus 4K times the five will be the voltage across V sub X, and that's 3.75 volts. The current I is just gonna be the voltage across the 3K resistor divided by 3K. But this voltage is three times V sub X, and that's three times 3.75. We're gonna divide that by the 3K. The threes cancel and we get 3.75 divided by 1K, which is 3.75 milliamps. And this is supplemental problem 4.8.